often the hardest thing in science fiction is coming up with a point of view for the world that you're creating. We spend most of our time with our hero tribe, which is the alchemy. Baba Voss is the leader of the tribe. He's got a responsibility to protect their village and his family. The tribe is a mountain tribe, maybe 65, 75 people, somewhat isolated from other tribes. Uh, as the show goes on, we get to open up the world and see a lot of different tribes. We have a plastic tribe, we have a metal tribe, we have the rope tribe, which is our alchemy. The world isn't just our small little universe. We are creating an entire world. Something's different. The children, they have the ability to see. Now, it will come for us. If vision disappeared for 600 years, even the concept of it would be gone. There would be no way of describing what it is. And so, for the people who don't have it, when it returns, it's witchcraft and it's evil. Baba Voss's tribe exists within a larger nation called the Pion Nation that is governed by a queen. Queen Cain's afraid that people with vision might have a power over her, and so she sends the witch finder out to look for the children. For centuries, we feared this day would come. The evil of light once almost destroyed the world. And now it has returned. Find the children who can see and bring them to me. These two children, their true father, kind of a mythical figure named Gerla Morel. These children are a gift. They will bring knowledge. They will begin a new world. They're the first humans that have been able to see in hundreds and hundreds of years. So together, they have protected children. I have to keep you safe. I have been looking for you for a lifetime.